Where's your other Valentine's? Don't you need some for the whole class? In my backpack. What's so special about that one? It's for this boy. Oh, a boy you say? Not like that, Jackie. He's just a friend of mine. Okay, so he's someone who I want to be my friend. All right, well, what's his name? Lily, that's her name. What, the girl you like? I don't like her. Come on, y yeah, you do. Okay, so yeah, I like her. So what's your plan? My plan? Yeah. Do you have a special Valentine's for her or something like that? I chose one that says, you're super cool. Is that too obvious? Should I put her name on a different one? What if he thinks that I'm going to actually go out or something? Well, you're in the fifth grade. I think that's a little too early to be thinking about dating. So I think you're in the clear. You're right. It's just Valentine. Yeah. And I don't think Bryce is going to assume you want to marry him after you give it to him. Look, Dustin, dude, it's all right. Don't you just want to hang out with her more or something? I was going to ask her to be my girlfriend. <laughs> oh. Wait, you, yeah, yeah, don't do that. Why not? Dude, I'm going to tell you a story of when I was in the fifth grade, all right? So I really liked this girl, but I knew I'd never have a chance with her. So I never asked. What was her name? Jacqueline. Preston. That was his name. And I really liked this boy, all right? Like, a lot. He was funny, and he was smart, and he was so nice to everyone. Well, he, even though we didn't talk that much. And how is this related to me? Well, a few days before Valentine's Day, this other boy, he asked me to be his girlfriend. Ew. Yeah, major ew. <laughs> so, what did you say? Yeah, she told him no. Really? Really. She said she would... Actually, she was quite disgusted, first off. She said she would never have a boyfriend. She thought all boys saw cooties or something like that. Cooties don't exist. Maybe they don't, but the point is... I knew she did not want to have a boyfriend, so when Valentine's Day came around, I knew I would not be asking that. So I wanted to make sure I had the perfect Valentine. I, I wanted to get his attention. And? Did it work? I actually never needed it. It all sort of worked out naturally. Can't we go outside and play kickball with everyone else? It's boring in here. You can. I'm going to see if Miss Hard Eyes over here is actually going to go talk to the love of her life. I'm telling you, Jacqueline, if you like him that much, you should just go talk to him. Are you nuts? I can't just go up to him and get pummeled with that football. Not now, of course. We mean later. We have our Valentine's Day party after a science lesson. So, maybe you can talk to Nick. Nope, not happening. I'm just going to sit right here and watch from the sidelines. Will you just man up and go talk to her? I mean, it's really not that hard. Will you just let it go? I need more time to think. You need more time? You've had enough time, Preston. I mean, Jack asked her out like a week ago. You've had a week. So, just let it go. Come on, just give it back. Nah. If you're not going to make a move, then I'll make one for you. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Um, that was my friend. Yeah, and... yeah I'm okay. Um, here's your ball. Hey, Preston. Um, do you want to maybe sit with me at lunch today? Yeah. Yeah, for sure. That's it? That's all you did? That's all she did. Well, what happened after that? And we became really good friends from that day on. It was that easy? Yeah, it was that easy. I can do that. Yeah, don't wait for him to come talk to you. You go and you talk to him. What if she doesn't want to talk to me? Then she doesn't want to talk to you. No big deal. There are plenty of fish in the sea, my friend. Are you still friends now? Yeah, totally. I mean, her family moved away a few years ago, so we don't really get to see each other that much. But you're still friends. Yeah. Yeah, we're still friends. Good friends, too. He lived in our old neighborhood before we moved, and so I don't really get to see him as much. But we still keep in touch. So, should I still give him my valentine? If you want to. You put so much thought into it, and I know Bryce is going to love it. Okay, I'll do it. There you go. 
Uh, go wait in the car. I'll meet up with you in a second. All right, so let's get this straight. When you see her, what are you gonna say? Lily, do you want to sit with me at lunch today? All right, madam man. Nice job. I call shotgun. Where else are you gonna sit? So guess who just had to coach their little brother into asking the girl he likes to sit with him at lunch? Ah, and wherever did you get that idea? Hey, I only give out my personal experiences. I actually just told the same story to JC. She's crushing on this boy, Bryce. Yeah, Dustin's been going on about this girl Lily for weeks now. For his sake, I hope she accepts, accepts the offer. Oh, I'm sure she will. Just as long as he doesn't hit her in the head with a football. Yeah. Uh, so. Do you have a valentine this year? No. You know that spot's saved for one person and one person only. Unless they're already taken. Uh, no. <laughs> Boys have cooties. You know that. Except for me. Yeah, except for you. Hey, come visit real soon, okay? No, I, I will. I, I promise. Alright. Happy Valentine's Day, Jacqueline. Happy Valentine's Day, Preston. Now I gotta say 